Hey, what's up guys, Lunica here, and today I'm going to be playing the Destiny 2 beta because it's finally released, and I'm super excited to play this with you guys now. As you can see, I'm rocking the Hunter class, and I will show you which subclass I'm going with, the Gunslinger subclass, which I prefer over the Arc Strider any day. My setup right now is the Better Devil's Hand Cannon, the Scout Rifle, and the Sniper Rifle. And I try to get my Resilience, Mobility, and Recovery as even out as possible on my character and you can do that by getting different armor pieces and getting different stats for those but i'm gonna hop into a match of control and we'll see what we can do all right guys we're gonna be playing today on endless veil which is the only control map out for the beta right now so no surprise there that's my hunter up in the front holding the better devil's hand cannon I know you can now we're gonna go I here and we're gonna see character. how we can do now, as you can see, I'm going to be rocking mostly just a scout and hand cannon combo for this match because I prefer the range along with the close range engagements, mainly with my hand cannon. Uh, there's a hole right down there, which I feel like someone's going to be jumping up soon. No, someone's already behind us this way. Hand cannon. Got him. And we kept zone B, so right now we have zone advantage and it's already 5 nothing. So I'm hoping we can do very good. Now I'm not going to take that fight. In fact, I'm going to just get right out of there. And there's someone below me, and he was just able to finish me off. The one thing I don't like about Hunter so far is that the recovery is super bad. So in between engagements, you have to wait at least a good like 10, 15 seconds before you can get all your health back. Now I was able to go in there and clean up that kill. And I have a feeling there's going to be a guy right here if I can hit my shots on him. But now I'm getting shot at by more than one person, yeah. A big thing about this game is team shotting. The team shotting should be on point if you want to do good. So in the competitive mode, which I should be showing you guys later at some point, team shotting is the entire thing. As you can see, I'm using a swarm grenade, which was in Destiny 1, but was more... It wasn't as good, I want to say. But I think I might be able to get that guy on my grenades. I am. As you can see, I have still throw a knife with the Gunslinger class. If you guys played Destiny 1 and you guys saw the Gunslinger class, there's not too many changes. Just uh, little tweaks here and there to make it better. But they also have a dodge move, kind of like Shadow Step, which I'll show you here in a second. Or I'm in the fight with this guy. And this guy's running away right now. Got him. Oh, but there's another with a linear fusion right when he got me. Like I said, in a lot of this, in Destiny 2, it's never really just fighting one person. It's mostly you, like, fighting two or three at the same time. It's not very good. But, if you can see what they kind of did now, is if you even get kill participation, it counts as an enemy defeated, not necessarily an enemy killed. So you still be getting credits, and that goes towards your KD and KD ratio. And it looks like there's some people over on B. I'm gonna load a little bit before I take that fight. Actually, I saw that there's more than one person. I'm going to go ahead and take this fight with whoever's over here. I already missed my first two shots in the engagement, and I'm probably going to be going down there, yeah. Use you as bait, little Uzi Squirt is the clan name. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Funny names. Alright, well, right now we're still up, but it looks like they're starting to come back, and that's not a good thing. That guy's shooting me right now with a freaking the sweet business auto rifle. Which is what the, what Titans get. And it's a very powerful auto rifle. Not so I really want to challenge too often, but it's gonna be right there. And we managed to trade. And another thing you're gonna notice here is with crucible matches in competitive and quick play, you do not get your super that often. You will be lucky to get your super once a match. And you can see power ammo is now like the special weapons from Destiny 1. Such as a sniper, shotgun, etc. Let's see. Oh, I was not able to get any. And those guys got the power weapons before us, and they were able to come all the way over and kill us as we were trying to get ours. Only one person gets it every open, every time you open it up, too, which is kind of weird, but it, it does make the game more fair, balance. There's some people low. I'm gonna chuck my swarm grenade. Hope it traps some people. Get that guy right there. Nice, nice. Swarm behind us. I'm missing all my shots. In fact, we both missing lots of shots. Where did he go? Let me swap out to my scout. Ah, oh, no. <laughs> that was such a stupid fight. We both did so bad there. <laughs> we should both be embarrassed about that. 
I right, managed to get to finish off that guy's kill. The one thing I could do is finish off kills pretty nicely. 1v1 fights I'm still struggling with, but finishing off kills is something else. Oh, that guy's low, but he's just going back out and regen health. Should be a guy coming right here. Managed to help clean him up. Ooh, turn around and pocketed that guy. There should be some more over here, as you can see on the radar top left corner right now. I think they're down here. I'm going to go take this fight. I probably shouldn't, though. Got him. He didn't even turn around. That was a shutdown, too, so I got an extra point out of that. I don't know if I just cap Alpha, because they're going to be capping Brawler over there. As you see, I'm pretty close to my super. I should be able to get it this match, which I'm pretty happy about. The Golden Gun, it's a bit different. It's not necessarily as powerful. You can still one-shot regular people, but whenever they're in super, it takes two shots. But you also get six shots with it. But another downside is that it takes so long to try and... That guy's in this healing station. Warlocks can put down healing stations, and I challenge that guy on one when I really shouldn't have. But as I was saying, the the cooldown for Golden Gun is so... Like, as soon as you pop it, you have five seconds to try and get all six shots off. It's 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 something very different. I was going to sit here and try and nail it. Nope, it didn't work. Oh, I didn't manage to get him fly grenades, though. I didn't manage to go right through a shield. Shouldn't have uh, antagonized him like that. I do use the swarm grenades. They so far seem like the best class to or the best grenade to use for the gunslinger class, just because of the tracking on them. They're very uh, that's what I'm looking for. They're very reliable in a sense. If you even just get it, and then we're getting chased by a fist of havoc right now. Oh jeez. Ah, he even ran out of fist of havoc, but he still just had the the death stalker for AU. Oh, that gun I've heard is able to tear people up. Now we're going to get here and hopefully find some people and use our super. And let's see if we can manage to not whiz every shot like we're in one of uh, Rat Chop's videos here. Alright, got that one. And I'm whiffing more shots. And it just ran out as soon as I'm about to shoot the last guy. Oh, he just knew the bomb me too. It's a really close match right now. It's 71-71. I'm second on my team, so I guess I'm doing my part. You captured zone B. You have zone oh, man, she get that kill? Come on, we only need one more. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. We just need one more kill. It's one. First, next one to get a kill wins. No. Is still close. We made it. Oh, man, we lost by one point. That's the closest control match I've had yet. But I'm sorry. Damn, I think though that we're going to be going into a competitive match and I'm going to be going in there and we're going to see how we can do in that. I did manage to come top of my team though, right there, 15 out of 1.15 efficiency, that's not bad. But we're going to go see what we can do in competitive mode. Alright guys, so I can't really find another match right now, so I'm just going to bring you guys some more competitive play later and hopefully with some friends too. Now... I hope you guys are all enjoying the beta just as much as I am, and if you can, I'm sure I'll see you all on Destiny 2, and I know it's going to be a great time, so I'll catch you all later. Deuces.